Street Station project is nearing an end, but it needed a final touch. So a call was put out to Mesquite artists to produce public artwork. Downtown Development Manager Beverly Abel is here to discuss the contest and its results. In, tw in 2019, actually, um, when we were reviewing the start of the Front Street Station program, uh, it became obvious very quickly that we were going to have some very large uh, surfaces for public art opportunities in, in the uh, Front Street Station area. And these came in the form of something that doesn't sound too glamorous, but is actually very visible. And those are seven foot by 10 foot uh, concrete walls that are surrounding dumpsters. Those are right in the middle of Front Street Station as you go through and they're really prominent and they actually offer great opportunities for information and for art and for something great uh, to see as you're down there enjoying events and just uh, visiting downtown. And so with that, uh, our downtown uh, advisory board joined forces with the Mesquite Arts Center and uh, their arts board. And we decided that we'll do a call for artists to solicit artwork from Mesquite in the surrounding area uh, to have them submit their work um, and have it considered for selection and inclusion in this first public art project at Front Street Station. So what type of art was the board looking for? You know, it really wasn't so much about media or even um, whether it was non-subject matter or literal or uh, any kind of application. It was more um, about creating a fun, uh, reflective and um, authentic space for people of Mesquite. Something that says, welcome to Mesquite, this is Mesquite, um, and something that would set us apart. That's great. And so what was it about these specific art pieces that really spoke to the board that they said, yes, this is what we want to display at Front Street Station? Well, first of all, we kind of had to take in consideration some technical things, including the uh, way a piece could lend itself to reproduction, because given that these are going to be in areas that are exposed to the elements and all that that entails, it needed to be reproduced well on a uh, screen that, that, you know, deals with wind resistance and, and uh, extreme heat and sun and all of that stuff. It also, the pieces also had to relate to a 10 foot wide and seven foot high um, um, space to be able to rep be reproduced. So something that was, uh, too vertical in, in its orientation just was not going to work as well as something that was more horizontal. So after that part of the process, then our, our board went in and, you know, they looked for skill and execution, then, but they really looked for um, being reflective of the community and uh, being authentic and adding uh, a really interesting visual dynamic to the area as you're visiting. So um, what they did is, is all of them on their own examined the pieces and viewed them and uh, measuring them against the criteria, scored each piece from zero to 10, 10 being the very best that, that they, a piece could do. And through that scoring, uh, the, of course, the eight highest scoring pieces were selected for the project. You can learn more about the contest and the artwork that will be displayed at Front Street Station at www.cityofmesquite.com. Thank you, Beverly, so much for joining me today. And as always, thank you for watching the Mesquite Minute.